Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Patricia and I have a Lush haul for you today. So I just got these products in this afternoon and I wanted to show you guys what all I got. So here is my box of goodies. So let's dive right in. So you know I am all about vegan perfume. So we have the Gorilla Perfume and this is the Karma Scent. Karma is the cult classic favorite in Lush, so I had to get it. So this is my first time buying Lush perfume, so here we have the Karma. And the notes for Karma are patchouli, sweet orange, and lemongrass. And it is an ode to hippies and head shops. So of course when you smell this, the first thing you smell is the patchouli and also the grape not the grapefruit the sweet orange that is the very first thing i smelled was the orange and the patchouli so this is a really good scent i put this on about maybe three two a couple of hours ago and of course i can still smell it it smells great it is very hippy trippy so if you are into all of that i mean the hippiness the people it reminds me of the people wearing black dyed hair tons of jewelry i am here for it so i absolutely love it you have got to try this this is lush in a bottle the next scent i got is lust this was one that i just had to try this is very very jasmine-y full of jasmine so if you do not like jasmine do not get this scent because this is really this is hard hitting punch you in the face jasmine so it is a mix of jasmine elang elang rose vanilla and sandalwood and it's described as a rich floral with a warm and woody base so i put this one on around five hours ago and I can slightly smell it but when you first put this on it is very strong so it's very strong and it is jasmine strong so you kind of have to wait for it to die down a little bit to really enjoy it to get the other notes on top of the jasmine but jasmine is punching you in the face with this one so if you love florals this is for you if you do not like jasmine you better keep it moving the next scent is amelie may this is a floral scent i got this in the smaller um size i decided to go ahead and get this in a solid because i just wanted to try it out and i knew i would like it because it was described as a floral but I didn't want to go ahead and spend more money in buying it. I just wanted to try it out. And I didn't want to do the wash card. So I decided to just do the solid. So here we go. And I'm just going to put it on my hand because I already have uh, karma on this wrist and the lust on this one. It's a very nice, I don't know why I'm showing you that like you can see it, but very nice floral scent i like this one a lot so emily may is described as a sugar candy floral it has ylang ylang rose and raspberry and you can smell the raspberry you can smell the rose a little bit but it's just a really beautiful floral so i will probably go ahead and get this in the spray at some point when I finish this. So I decided to get some wash cards. Wash cards are the best way to try out a fragrance without spending a bunch of money. They're only two dollars each. They're like a dollar ninety five. So I got vanilla air vanilla -y. and of course you know that is a vanilla scent, natural vanilla absolute, sandalwood, jasmine, and tonka bean. I picked up Oh, Sikkim Girls, and that is described as a warm and exotic floral. It has jasmine, tuberose, and frangipani, or frangipani, sorry about that. I also picked up 
what would love do? And that is described as sweet and zesty. It has lavender and tangerine. And last but not least, I picked up Dirty. And that is described as a unisex scent. And it has sandalwood, tarragon, thyme, and lavender. And last but certainly not least, we have samples. So if you purchase items from Lush, go ahead and ask for samples. All they can do is say no or they don't have it. But I've heard over and over again, if you ask for samples, they will give you samples. So I got a boatload of samples with my order. So I have a sample of Angels on Bare Skin. And if you open that up, there is the sample that I got. So that's a good little amount. So you take this and you just um, crumble it in your hand. You add some water and you wash your face with it. It is a cleanser made with cannolin clay, ground almonds, lavender rose, and chamomile. So excited about that. I also got some of the hippie, hippie, happy hippie shower gel. And I'm just going to, because it's, I don't want to tilt it too much, but you can kind of see it, it's a decent amount. It'll probably be one wash. So this contains grapefruit juice, zesty grapefruit, and bergamot oil. So it smells really zesty and citrusy, and it's going to wake you up in the morning. So I can't wait to use it. I got a sample of the Rose Argon Body Conditioner. I was excited about that. Now this sample isn't a whole lot, but it'll probably be one good use. So... I'm happy with that. It smells like rose jam, so you know it smells absolutely great. Um, this is made with cocoa shea, capuchu butters, Brazil nut, almond, and argan oils, and it gives a soft vanilla rose scented skin. So if you like rose jam, you got to get this one. I also have some of the dream cream so i got a decent sample of that as well so i'll go ahead and open it up so you can see so you really get some good samples so ask for the samples so the dream cream is it's a lotion it's gentle it's made with oak milk lavender chamomile olive oil and cocoa butter I also got a couple of solid soaps, and you can see these are really good sizes of the soap. So I got the Karma soap. Of course, the Karma smells just like the cologne. This is a really big sample, so I'm really excited about that. And I got the Fig and Leaves soap. I don't know if you can see it, but there's little bits of leaf. In there this is a fig soap that has little leaves in it so the description of it says it's made with orange blossom figs ylang ylang and aloe vera and last but certainly not least is defluff now this was a freebie that I received with my order defluff is a strawberry shaving soap it smells like strawberries and look at the color Look how beautiful that is, and look how thick it is. Look at that. It's not going anywhere. Absolutely beautiful. So D-Fluff is, as I said, a shaving soap, and it is made of fresh strawberries, egg whites, golden syrup, mixed with rosehip oil, coconut oil, maple sugar. So it says, for best results, let it sit for three to five minutes before you start to shave. So that's it. Have you tried any of the products in this video? Comment below, let me know. I will come back at a later date and I will let you know how I liked all of the things that I have used in the video. But I just wanted to come on, show you what I got. Now I have another video coming up. I bought from the UK site, you guys. I bought from the kitchen. So I should be getting that next week so or this week later this week so after i get it i will come back and it's only three products i just wanted to do a little tiny uk haul but 
I will come on and let you know how everything went with that. So if you have any questions, please list them below. And as always, please remember to thumbs up, comment, subscribe, share, turn on those post notifications. And as always, have a great day and I will talk with you later. Bye.